Hi, Susie Valentine here, and you're probably wondering what I'm wearing. And this is a heart monitor. I've been wearing this for a whole week. It's called the Zio XT, and I get to take it off today. So I'm super excited, and I'm gonna send it off and get my results. So I've been wearing this this past week because I've been having some heart uh, palpitations and some skipping the beats. I guess my husband still makes me skip a beat, huh? <laughs> so I wanted to show you what it looks like and how it works because I had no idea and I wish there was a video like this to explain to you what it was. So it's this heart rate monitor that you wear. They stick it on and this is what tracks it as well as these sensors. And they stick it on and it is very itchy, but you just have to ignore it and just keep going on with your day. And the first couple nights, it was a little difficult sleeping because you feel like there's something there, but you just have to ignore it and try to get a good night's rest. And let me give you some information about this in case you have any questions. So it comes with this patient instructions as well as a button press log. And anytime you feel that you've had uh, some abnormal heart palpitations, you just push this button and it gives them information. However, even if you forget to press the button, it is tracking you 24 seven. So don't worry, even in your sleep, it tracks you. So let me show you what the booklet looks like. Another nice thing is there's an app as well that you can download, but I just wanted to use the booklet. You just have to press the button anytime you feel anything um, out of the ordinary. If the patch starts falling off, make sure to call the company. And they also say do not shower for 24 hours just so the patch adheres very well. And as well as do not exercise too much that you become too sweaty the first 24 hours too. Okay, so let's read some of these instructions. What if I forget to press the button when I feel a symptom? While pressing a button is important, the Zio XT patch is recording every heartbeat. So see, you don't have to worry about it. And what if I press the button but forget to write down the information in the booklet or record it in the My Zio app? It says, while the information is useful, pressing the button indicates that you felt your symptoms at that time. And what if I don't have any symptoms? That's okay. The Zio XT patch records every heartbeat. Can I exercise while wearing the Zio XT patch? Yes but excessive sweating may shorten wear time. Within the first 24 hours of wearing the XT patch, it is recommended that you avoid activities which may cause excessive sweating. Can you shower with the Zio XT patch on? Yes, but please avoid showering during the first 24 hours of wearing the patch. After that, take brief showers with your back facing the shower head and keep soap and lotions away from the patch. While towel drying, hold down the XT patch with one hand and press it against your skin to secure. Now, the way I took a shower was my husband and I, we put painter's tape as well as cellophane to cover this up. And here's a tip. Wash your whole body first and then do your hair. That worked best for me. So I wanted to let you know because I finally got into the rhythm of how it works most effectively because you don't want to get this wet. So what I was using is cellophane and painter's tape to keep it dry while I take a shower. Can I go swimming in a hot tub? No, the XT should not be submerged in water. Is it normal for the patch to move slightly from its original position? Yes, it may move a little slightly. Is it normal to experience skin irritation or itchiness in the area? Yes, yes, yes but just try not to itch it because you don't want it to mess up uh, the sensors. Is it normal for the patch wings to become cloudy? Yes, it may become cloudy after a few days. And also you may have some of your clothing get stuck the lint around the sticky area. So just be aware of that. What if the Zio patch flashes orange while I'm wearing it? That means that the connection has become loosened. So don't worry, your heart is working normal. It just means be aware that you need to secure the patch again. Is it normal to experience skin irritations? Yes, it is noted that there are some people that experience mild skin irritation as well as itchiness too. Now you just have to ignore it. However, if you develop highs or an irritation that is severe or blisters too, please call customer service at 1-888-693-2401. Another thing that you might wonder is if it's working. 
However, as soon as the nurse or doctor put it on you, it is working. They've already tested it out. So don't worry because you're not gonna hear any noise and you're not gonna see any flashing lights either. Can you travel with the Zio patch on? Yes, and if you have any issues with security, then you just have to show them this that shows that you are wearing a heart monitor. <laughs> it's like your doctor's note. Here's the button press log, and you write down anytime you feel any symptoms. You write down the date, the time, as well as why. Because I felt anxious, arm or neck pain tingling, chest pain or pressure, dizziness, fainted, lightheaded, pounding, fluttering or racing, short of breath, skipped beats or irregular beats, or other. Then you write for this duration. How long did it last? One minute or less, 10 minutes or less, one hour or less, or more than one hour. And then you write what you were doing. While I was, and then you fill in the blank. You get several pages. And if you fill it up too much, you can always write it on a different sheet of paper. They give you instructions on how to remove it. And once we remove it, we're going to put the patch on here and then we're going to put it in this box and it's already pre-addressed stamped and we're gonna mail it in. So let's take it off so you can see what it looks like. Bear with me, I've never taken this off before. I've actually never had a heart monitor before. So let's see how this goes. They give you this adhesive tape remover pad. So it says, apply pad to edge of tape. Pull tape gently while applying pad to line of adhesion. Wipe skin with pad to clean remaining adhesive residue. Okay, let's try this out. Okay, so it's like a little alcohol pad. I guess we're going to apply it around and start pulling it off. Hmm. It actually feels like maybe it's like some oil. Hmm, smells good. Okay, so I guess you just keep applying and pulling. Apply and pull, apply and pull. Yay, it's coming off. I can't believe I've had this on for a whole week. Yeek. Almost there, it's off, yay! And as you can see, the orange light is flashing because it is off my skin. And this is what it looks like. And now, we're going to get this and put it on like this. And then we're going to use this to seal the box with this tape and mail it at the post office. So as you can see, it just left a little bit redness. No big deal. So excited to see what the results are gonna be. They also included the survey and questionnaire to see how they did. And you can fill it out, it is optional. It says, we would love to hear your feedback. Please answer the questions on the back of this card and return it with your device. May we contact you to discuss your Zio experience, yes or no? And if yes, please provide your email address here. The back says, the device was easy to use, strongly disagree to strongly agree. The device was comfortable to wear. I was able to go about my normal activities. If I needed a heart monitor in the future, I would wear a Zio device. Have you ever worn a heart monitor before wearing the Zio device? If yes, how did your Zio experience compare to your previous heart monitor experience? So I guess I'm gonna have to fill out the survey and send it in the box. And then I'm going to include this booklet and close this up and use that provided tape to seal the box. So thank you so much for watching. And I really appreciate it. Hope you found this video helpful and wishing you a wonderful day.